Well, a lot of people have been speaking out on the Max Pacioretty Zidane Chera incident from the game involving the Boston Bruins and the Montreal Canadiens. Uh, shortly after 9 p.m. tonight, Max Pacioretty reached out, contacted me, and had some comments of his own to talk about. Not only the hit, as well as the league's decision to not suspend Zidane Chera, but also his relationship with Chera. Let's have a look here. Uh, I'm upset and disgusted that the league didn't think enough of the hit to suspend him. I'm not mad for myself. I'm mad because if other players see a hit like that and think it's okay, they won't be suspended and other players will get hurt because I got hurt. It's been an emotional day. I saw the video for the first time this morning. You see the hit. I've got a fractured vertebrae. I'm in hospital and I thought the league would do something, a little something. I'm not talking a big number. I don't know, one game, two games, three games, whatever, but something to show that it's not right. Max Patch already doesn't remember much of what happened last night. He said the first time that he had any, any memory was when he was loaded on the stretcher and he was going off the ice and he wondered why everybody was making such a big deal of it. Uh, it was obviously an emotional day for him today. He met his father, Ray, and his mother, Anna, this morning at the hospital from Montreal General and said that his father broke down in tears after seeing, because he didn't see the hit, he was at the game live, but didn't get a real good look at it until the day after the fact. Uh, as for the relationship with Zidane Chera, these two have had a running battle. Pacioretty said it's, this incident was not part of that running battle. It dates back to a game in January, but he did say, I heard Chera said he didn't mean to do it. I felt he did mean to do it. I would feel better if he said he made a mistake and that he was sorry for doing that. I could forgive for that but I guess he's talking about how I jumped up or something. I believe he was trying to guide my head into the turnbuckle. We all know where the turnbuckle is. It wasn't a headshot like a lot of headshots we see, but I do feel he targeted my head into the turnbuckle. So Max Pacioretty obviously feels strongly about what went down. He's not happy that the National Hockey League did not suspend, although he says he wasn't looking for a super suspension of 10 or 20 games like a lot of fans of the Montreal Canadiens. He said he's been encouraged by the support that he's received from Montreal Canadiens fans in the hospital. That it means a lot to him. He's getting terrific medical care. And he's not quite sure what his prognosis is on the medical front. He said that they're going to deal with one thing at a time. He says he feels surprisingly well. Uh, in terms of the concussion symptoms and has not had any exacerbated symptoms at this point in time. As for the fractured vertebrae, he says it'll get to uh, more attention from the doctors uh, as the days unfold while they deal with some other issues. He's currently on blood thinners and needs to take care of a few other issues before they get to that. He's not sure when or if he'll be able to play hockey again, but he absolutely says it's his goal to come back and play in the National Hockey League. Throw it back to the desk.